Hey everyone, welcome back to another interesting video. In this video, we are going to solve another interesting problem, which is find the values of x such that 2 raised to x plus 4 raised to x is equal to 8 raised to x. So, if we look at this equation, then we can write this 4 raised to x as 2 square raised to x, right? 8 raised to x as 2 cube raised to x and this 2 raised to x as it is, right? Which is same as we can take this 2 here and x here, right? 2 raised to x, it's square and similarly 2 raised to x, it's cube, right? Now, for any value of x, we know that 2 raised to x is always positive. That means it is not 0. So, divide throughout this equation by 2 raised to x, we get 1 plus 2 raised to x is equal to 2 raised to x, it's square, right? Now, at this point, it seems to be an equation in 2 raised to x, right? So, we can call 2 raised to x as some variable for our simplicity. So, let's call y is equal to 2 raised to x. So, this equation becomes 1 plus y is equal to y square, right? And we can easily solve this equation. It is quadratic equation. So, it is y square minus y minus 1 is equal to 0. So, the roots of this equation are y is equal to 1 plus or minus square root 5 by 2, right? Now, we know that y is equal to 2 raised to x, which is always positive, right? And if we look at this, then this 1 plus square root 5 by 2 is positive, whereas 1 minus square root 5 by 2 is negative. So, we should not take the negative value of y here. So, we have y is equal to 1 plus square root 5 divided by 2, right? That means we have 2 raised to x is equal to 1 plus square root 5 by 2 from here. Now, if we take natural log on both the sides, then we can find the value of x, right? So, by taking natural logarithm on both the sides, we get ln of 1 plus square root 5 by 2, right? But this is equal to x times ln of 2, which is equal to ln of, now apply the rules of logarithm, this is equal to 1 plus square root 5 minus ln of 2, right? Now, natural log of 2 is positive, so we can divide by ln of 2, we get x is equal to 1 plus square root 5 minus ln of 2 divided by ln of 2, right? Now, this x is equal to ln of 1 plus square root 5 divided by ln of 2 minus 1. So, that means what? The solution of this equation is unique, which is just a real number ln of 1 plus root 5 by ln of 2 minus 1. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching.